yo what's up guys go to here back into the video and i have a lot of things to explain as you can see by my upload schedule it's been a while since i've uploaded to be exact it has been almost two months since i've uploaded a video so basically the main reason was that i had really really important exams but as you guys know that exams mostly end in a month or so so actually what happened is after my exams i actually got a bit sick and due to that i couldn't make any videos so yeah now i'm actually feeling very very good and i'm back in the youtube game so yeah thank you guys so much for supporting we actually hit 15,000 subscribers and that is a huge milestone so thank you guys so much for that um expect a lot of uploads from now on because your boy is actually back in the youtube game i am actually very very sorry for not uploading for more than a month yes like a normal kid i also study so that was the main reason so yeah i apologize but thank you guys so much for supporting but aside from the issues your boy is back with a tier list video and in fact a fighting style tier list video a lot of people were asking for a tier list video on fighting style so here i am making this video so before we start if you guys enjoy this video or like it even a little bit make sure to hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button so yeah without wasting any more time let's get right into the video so as you guys can see we have all the fighting cells down here and these are all the tiers they are must use very good good bad and trash so yeah basically we're going to be ranking all of these fighting cells down here into these tiers so at first you guys will be wondering what this fighting style is and this one is actually the combat whenever you join blocks fruits you actually have this fighting style and um yes for all the trollers and memers this one is a must use fighting style but unfortunately for the people who like to grind or to pvp in this game it is actually trash it doesn't have any decent moves or anything like that so yeah i'm not going to be even talking about this fighting style i just had to mention it for the memers and for the people who like to troll so um yeah for you guys it's up in the must use section the next one we have is actually one of the best fighting styles in the game and this is known as superhuman this one is actually pretty expensive to obtain but is a really really good fighting style all the requirements of this fighting style are up on screen right now i'm not going to be telling you guys every single requirement for all of these fighting styles because that's going to just make the video longer so i'm just going to be telling you guys about its moves and its combos and everything like that so if we talk about the moves of superhuman the first move is just like a super good combo starter you just grab your opponent and then punch them a lot of times so that's like a really good move if you guys are willing to start a combo the second one the thunderclap is actually a pretty good aoe move you can do that whenever you're stuck in somebody's combo or you just want to distance away from your opponent the third move is actually my favorite it can be used at the end of the combos like you just press c at the end it just pushes your opponent back and does a lot of damage and basically goes with literally every single combo so yeah it is actually a super op move but overall if you talk about the fighting style the moves the combos the damage everything is above average and is actually very very good so this one actually deserves to be in the must use section the next one we have is electro electro is actually a starting fighting style as previously the requirements will be mentioned up on screen right now this one is actually not that bad and not that good for early gamers this one is actually very very good because this fighting style is basically based on stunning your opponents and as you guys know for starters that's a very very good thing you can just gather up a lot of energy pcs and then stun them at a single place and just kill them easily but this is only for starters keep that in mind this is not for anybody who's even in the second c so yeah it's gonna go in the bad tier yes it's gonna go in the bad tier but it is a extremely good fighting style or even one of the best fighting styles for starters so yeah keep that in mind the next one we actually have is one of my personal favorites and this one is death step this one is actually very very good and really really op once again the requirements are up on screen yes it is a bit difficult to obtain but superhuman is a bit harder or at least a bit more time consuming but that step has super super low cooldowns and the moves are a bit more fun than superhuman so the moves of this fighting style are actually very very good the first move is like a jump attack um you just basically aim at a spot and just move to it and deal a bit of damage also has a bit of a flame effect around it so yeah the second one is actually 
actually a bullet which is very very good um it's basically like a super good attack if you want to attack your opponent in like a fast paced 1v1 match like basically your opponent is flying or he's just running on the ground very very fast his race is mink or something like that and um, you just want to hit him you can use the second move which is the wind bullet i think so if i remember correctly the third move is actually the drill move which does a lot of kicks at your opponent and um it's basically stuns your opponent at a place if you hit it right and it's actually very very op and does a lot of damage and also this is one of the few fighting cells which actually have a buffing move the last move of this is the devil flames which actually buffs the damage of all the other moves and makes them way more cooler and super fiery so that's why this one is a really really op fighting cell and you should definitely use it the next one is the fishman karate this one is also a starter fighting style and i'd say this one is one of my favorite starter fighting cells in the game the requirements are once again up on screen you guys can see how to obtain it what's its price and everything like that so yeah if we talk about its moves the moves are actually very unique and super good for farming if you guys are new to the game um obviously when you get better and you are a bit stronger you use superhuman or something like that but when you guys are a noob and you get your hands on this fighting style trust me it's gonna be worth it that is why this fighting style is actually pretty pretty good and will be going in the good tier rather than bad even though it's a starting fighting style then the next one we have is actually the dragon talon this one is actually a pretty op one basically to sum it up it's the baby of superhuman and death step um it basically has the f the first move is basically superhuman um but it has like fiery effects and like a bit more damage and somewhat of equal damage i am not sure which does more the second move is like a bullet attack and it is very very op and it's pretty fast as well like if you have your opponent in the first move and you do the second one it's going to land 100 percent like like for example if you were to do it with superhuman the third move is actually a super cool one and it's an aoe based attack just like the superhuman thunder clap as i told you before it's basically like the baby of superhuman at that step as you know the requirements are up on screen you guys can check them out why do i keep repeating that you guys already know they're up on screen ah oh, sometimes i'm so freaking dumb all right so the next one we have is the little brother of dragon talent the dragon breath this one is actually the first version of the dragon talent talent um so yeah this is somewhat of a starter fighting style it it is actually obtained in the second c so yeah according to that it should be very very good because superhuman and death step are like insanely good it should be very very good but it is not um it will go in the bad tier for me it doesn't have like a super op range or super op damage or in fact super op combos it doesn't have like a specific specialty that you should go for it's gonna be in the bad tier but electro is for sure a lot better than this one the next one we have is electric cloth this one was my favorite for a bit but then now i'm back to superhuman superhuman is actually very very op um it is insanely op it's basically based on stun it's the upgraded version of electro yeah the moves are pretty good they deal a lot of damage and uh, basically it can go with every single devil fruits in the game and that is actually a pretty good thing like like mostly not all fighting cells go with them for example if you were to talk about death step going with every single devil fruit no there's no way well yes it can go with every single one but the thing is but if you want to use its full potential then you have to have a devil fruit which suits up death step so yeah that's why it's a bit messy but um if you find a right devil fruit trust me it's insanely op the next one we have is the dark step this one is actually a pretty good starter fighting cell as well it's very cheap and um yeah also has like a buffing move the devil flames or something like that it is actually very very good for farming at the start of the game but later on it becomes very bad so this one should go in the good tier but i'm actually going to be putting fishman karate or the water kung fu uh in the very good section because that one is actually pretty good the next one we have is the sharkman karate this one is the last fighting cell of the video and is a very good one this one actually has really good damage and like somewhat of a good combo potential like this one is is actually very different from all the other fighting cells like the first move is like a dashing move it goes through your opponent and does like a decent amount of damage the second one is like a projectile and the third one is actually like pulling your opponent in and dealing damage and it's like super unique from all the other fighting cells and pretty pretty good as well so this one actually goes in the top tier as well like all of these fighting cells are super super good in plug fruits and you should definitely try them out thank you guys so much for watching if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to hit that subscribe button that really means 
a lot to me i'll see you guys in the next video peace